This video is sponsored by Y Food. I'm Dave. I'm Steven. I'm Dad. And I'm Son. Welcome to the episode of DJ Project, episode 89. So this week at DJ Project, Maureen's back. We've got plenty of fencing to do. We've got an interesting one where we have to use the sunny. We've got a sliding job. We have got to use our new little baby, the tiger. There'll be no concrete done this week because it's too cold. It's going to be a busy, busy, busy one. As you know, our boys always smash it. But before we start our day, guys, just want to say a massive thank you for everyone supporting. I want to say sorry for how the video ended on Sunday. I know you've had it on Monday, then a Wednesday, but now it's Sunday. Yeah. I don't know what happened with YouTube. For some reason, it does that. Dad did the playthrough, watched it, everything worked. I went to upload it, and then it missed 15, 16 minutes. So, no idea what happened, but we put it on Monday. Hopefully, you've saw it. If you haven't, it's in one of these corners now. So, go and finish it and see what the tarmac drive was looking like. So thank you for all of the support. The likes and the comments. We do go through all the comments. Yes. It's getting harder and harder to read all the comments. It's it like taking a couple of hours. <laughs> uh, that's not our graph. No. no, that's not our graph. <laughs> <laughs> so he's meant to be picking me up. So <laughs> yeah, a massive, massive thank you. We absolutely yeah. love you guys. We've got the best, best, best subscribers. 100%. 100%. So, with that said, it's really cold out here. I want to get in a warm cab and Steve yeah. wants to get in a cold garden. So see you later. That's it. <laughs> Oh, remember, like the video and subscribe if you're new, guys. 5,000 likes. 5,000. Come on, guys. We can do this. Oh, you can just see it there, guys. He's running over to Greg's. Got to have a drink. Probably going to have a little bite to eat as well. Absolutely Baltic again today. Minus one. Minus one on the phone. for that these cold weather days were done with, guys, man. I thought we were done. Oh, look at me here as old man. JP's got to sort me with that out today. Dad's is fresher than mine. Mine's three weeks. This is three weeks growth, guys. Beard, three weeks. No! <laughs> You're getting refurbed. You're getting refurbed. Oh my God, guys. That's why I couldn't park outside. <laughs> I feel sick. Oh, what's God doing to us? Uh, Costa. <laughs> we may as well get a Costa drink, can't we now? Oh, no. Oh, guys. Oh, that cop. It's not happening. Oh, I feel sick now. I've got to go. Sorry. Oh, hello, guys. Hello. We are on job site. We've had our costa. It was nice and warm, but we're back in the cold now. And we're on a little bit of a fencing install today. I believe this is for the tenants. I think it's for the students. I think this is like a student place, this one. But yeah, we're just replacing this bit of fencing here. It's pretty much had it. What we're going to have to do because we're going to the side of the house where it existing is now. So we will have to cut a big hole in there where the concrete is and then patch it back up. That's not a problem. That's absolutely fine. Wherever that concrete pad needs patching, once we've done our work, again, not a problem. We can sort that out, as you've seen plenty of times on this channel. It's going to be a six foot fence here. So I can already see over this quite easily. So I dare say it's going to be sort of up here somewhere. So it's gaining a few more inches. The plan is to probably attach to this. We don't really want to mess with next doors too much. What I'm going to do, I'm going to let next door know that we're going to be fencing in a sec. As you can see, you can see where the posts were. They were in the concrete. So that's what we're sort of going to aim for we're going to go sort of for the concrete use the gravel boards as the new retainer if needed yeah it's pretty much that guys so before i knock it down i'm going to go next door let them know that we're doing some work because it's always courteous is it courteous i believe it is to let offset your neighbor know because you sort of when you're doing fencing you've got to work on both sides both sets of boundary always nice to let the the, um, the neighbours know. If you can hear the sirens, it's because the uh, Queen's Medical Centre is up that way, so a little bit busy. And we're on the ring road. It's busy today. So let me go and speak to next door. If they'll uh, open up. And uh, we'll go from there, guys. Our customer has sent a letter off to next door, letting them know that uh, fencing's going to be done. That never happens. Never happens. Well, uh, let me get these tools around with Asnet, and uh, we'll catch back up and get that fence out. As mentioned earlier, this video is sponsored by Y Food. Y Food is a full 500 calorie meal replacement. For people like us, who are always busy, 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 this is the perfect product. So if you are like your girls and boys at DJ Projects, it's 500 calories right here. This one's Happy Banana, it's one of my personal favorites. This single bottle has 26 vitamin and minerals, high in fiber, lactose free, gluten free, and high in protein. So if you want to save yourself 10%, the link will be in the description below, DJ Projects, that's YouTube. I'd like to thank Y Food for sponsoring this video, and back to the video we go. I'm going to go through the comments, 
the one where you're always guessing the mileage of Big Red. See you one. And send you one of these bad boys. Yeah. Next door now, so let's get dark. Put one pan pot that size. Right, not one of them off. So, so, so. Doing too hot. This is why you only buy cheap tools, guys. Go for a nail. What, five pound? wanted concrete fencing he did not want cap rail so we said we will do what we've got to do it looks like guys that the fencing it's a massive crack here got to be careful of that it looks like the fencing was put in and then they porched up here let me just show you you can tell that it's not the same sort of form you see they've concreted up against the uh the feather edges you can almost see like original concrete and then they've they've got like this haunch in here so what me and asni will do because we're going to fence here has to be here can't go here of course and because that is neighbors we're going to go here and then work in a the line there any concrete that needs to get sawn and cut away that's fine because the gravel boards are going to be the new retainer and then we can fill in with concrete after so yeah so what we're going to do we're going to put our first post on the wall like this one was yeah, we'll get them, we? oh yeah we'll, we'll get that off we'll uh say our post is going somewhere say middle of brick guys say middle of brick and then run in a line and that will take us to side of that sort of uh well i'm assuming it was a garage once upon a time side of that that's the plan so hasn't it magic fingers if you would mate right here for us and there we have it guys that is sitting level don't be fooled by this brickwork it is sitting level got two in there for now feels absolutely solid using the 6.5 mil drill bits so a big shout out to you i think it was brian robson big shout out to you mate for sending those big 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 shout out because you're helping us out yeah this is pretty much where six foot falls pretty much where that one was so the plan now is cut a nice square out of it again we'll fill in the concrete we'll make it look good don't worry about it guys we'll probably even and cut a bit of that out you know just like a straight line once we've got our gravel board in we'll decide anyway but um yeah we'll just keep going guys uh what should we do with this one what we'll do we'll do clicky fingers as nick can use his fingers again to get this hole ready if he doesn't mind that is you don't mind me yeah, warm there we go then warm them up there we have it guys one hole to the abyss that you can't even see the bottom of so you know it's deep uh yeah we're gonna get a gravel board now i'm gonna put the gravel board right there because we need to see how much of a slope it is and then if it is too much of a slope we then need to get a steel saw to cut a little channel to make it go from this to this final prep before we can get this post in yeah looking good gonna get a nice straight line to the end look at this as well guys neighbor it's come out it's made us a cup of tea you can't beat it can you Asla? No, you I can't beat it lovely chap lovely chap of course we told him of course we'll tidy all this up he knows that but yeah we just had to take a little channel out you can see it with a steel saw channeled it off just so we can get the gravel board down again guys like we always mention we always like to do it straight I don't care, even if it is minuscule like that, it's not staying like that. It's got to go like that to start with. But yeah, uh, we need to make sure that we are around about 94, 95 inches deep to the top of shoulder. And then we know we're good to go, guys. So cliche, I see the sparks you throw my way. I know your name is written on everyone's mind.
I actually would have saw her on time lapse. We already had this one on, guys. We were not happy with the ground. So we decided to cut a channel out. We're going to double gravel board this one. So we're digging down deep enough to make sure that two gravel boards and 6x5 go to the top of the panel. Might have a little step. We'll see when we drop it in. But yeah, it's gravel board time. Get it level. And then we're good to go, guys. All right. Time to go back to the yard. Get the concrete that we need. Come back, tidy up this side and tidy up next door. So I guess we'll see you when we get back here. Not too shabby. That's another little quick install all done and dusted. Make sure it's nice and neat for the neighbor next door. Just gonna close this gate here and then straight back to the yard. Empty the van and the timber panels, which are here. Got a little bit of concrete on the back that the lads actually can um, crush. So that's always good. And that machine, oh, it looks good. They've been on it all day. From what I saw earlier, it looks like we've got some decent, decent hardcore there. So yeah. Let's head back to the yard and I'll show you. So, good morning. It is Monday morning. Where does the weekend go, guys? Where does that weekend go? What have you been up to this weekend? I hope you had a good one. Hope you're feeling well. We want all positive thoughts. And if you are feeling down, put a comment down below and your boys from DJ Projects will try and pick you up. Probably a little bit of a pick up with. Oh, the sun's out. Bright. Lovely day, happy day. Watching this, probably help you through them rough times. Remember, rough times don't last forever. So what we're we doing today, I'm on a bit of grab work with Jordan this morning. The lads are on the crusher. So they're crushing. They've all got their PPE on. Yeah, they're crushing. They're doing really, really well. They're going to be crushing. Jordan's going to be pulling the pile down. The reason why we're using the little digger bucket there and that bucket made up so we have to riddle it through a little bit yeah this is what the lads are going to be doing i'm coming back this afternoon i'm going to help them do a bit we're going to get the other crusher out get that working get all the posts behind me push all them through yeah it's really really loud but we'll catch up with these boys in a bit so that's the lads all sorted now we are off out to go and do our grabs so yeah we'll get the grabs done come back like i say We'll sort through with the sanner. Probably put the landscaping rake on. We'll get a shake out and that for him. So it's me, it's Jordan, and we are good to go. Yeah, we've got a couple of grabs to do, some black ice drop off, we're all loaded up, and we are ready to go. So then, our first one is an interesting one. I don't know if you see Jordan just through there working the cream, but yeah, we are on a slope. And I mean a really, really drastic slope. I'm sat in the cab because if anything does go wrong, I want to be in the cab so I can put the brakes on up and try to stop it. So, yeah, I'll show you. That slope doesn't look that bad. But when we've uh, unloaded, I will show you the gradient of it. It don't look that bad. The camera don't do it justice. So I'll stand at the bottom of the drive when we've unloaded and I'll show you. So Jordan's just lifting the uh, second bag off and you can't see it. There's a wire there as well. Can you see that wire? He's cleaning that window really, doesn't he? But yeah, there's a wire there. I'll show you when we're going down. So, down we go. So what goes up must come down. The best thing about it, it's not that wide as well. I just think we're wasting Nottingham. We ought to get a Apache helicopter or a Chinook to deliver bags. Probably Chinook. Some customers do. They think you've got, because it's got a crane on it, they think it'll crane over the arse. Or well, we can go on next door's drives and gardens and stuff. Obviously, this did get cleared. She has told next door, and I did so to her. Well, it's a 32 ton wagon. So, normally, we would not do this. And I do not like doing this as well because it's all right, them clearing it, but it's when they do the damage, then they deny all knowledge of it. But I made sure she actually had in front of me as asked the neighbor. But yeah, it's a steep one, guys. It is a steep one. Jordan just backing me down. And then what makes it worse when we do get to the bottom, I'm going to hook it round this lamppost, so I'm going to be facing the opposite way. But it makes it all worthwhile, the ladies made us a drink. So yeah, I don't know if you can pick up the telegraph wire as well. We've got a wall just on the right hand side of there, and when I'm back, then she got work to see, there's a lamppost as well. Yeah, first one on Monday morning, a bit of a tricky one. We're out. We are out. So 
So that's Paul Forrest's lamppost right behind me. I do, George. So then, there's that telegraph wire. Where we have dropped it. You just see our bags in the distance. That does, the camera don't do it justice. I don't know if you drag it down. But yeah, it don't look like a slow, but it is, trust me, it is. But the boys at D&J have done it. And what did she say, mate? Yeah, that was a smashing bit of manoeuvring. Now the neighbors know we can get up there. <laughs> They're gonna order some stuff. <laughs> Oh, hey, silver lining and all that. Good. So yeah, it looks like we're going to be coming back here, <laughs> going to the top of it this time. But yeah, lovely lady has made us a drink, so thank you very much, and we'll get this drank, and then we're going to go and see Manders, because he's got to grab and make sure we can reach it, because it's like two minutes away from here, and then we're going to drop some black ice off. So then guys, nice and dropped. That just wants to clean all bags on the front onto the next. So then guys, we've been here before. It's all these, all been sorted out. So we've got concrete, soil, a roadstone to return, some other green waste and sand and soil in this one. So let's get them on. So we have it nice and clean. The added advantage of that, putting it all in bags. Look, look how clean that is. So them lads have moved on to the next one now and it's all nice and clean, knowing full well that we'll get paid. So yeah, next time you see us, we're back at the yard unloading. Gonna unload these bags now. I'm gonna put the bag of concrete down there so the lads can crush it. Well, yeah, he's doing well. The crushing. So we've just tipped that off to be sorted with the screener. Now we've got another grab which come in for Manders. So let's go and get that. So we're back at the yard, guys, and we're having a staff meeting because I've got an air cut. Yeah. That's <laughs> so it. we've had it earlier. The time is. Where's the time? Quarter. Yes. Yeah, quarter four. Uh, employee of the month. We employees of the month because it was a draw with Chelsea and Jamie so they've got to wear their medals all yeah. this month we're going to get a picture of them now we've been through the meeting yeah and like I said earlier Maureen's back there we go so wish yeah. you some love in the comments probably going to leave it at this guys um, and we'll catch back up in the morning good morning it is Tuesday morning. I mean, Steve is in the office. We're just running through a few things with YouTube and the day ahead and the week ahead, what jobs we've got on, basically sorting out. So we are ready to go out. But before we do, this parcel's been sat on my desk for two days and we haven't had a chance to do a video. So I do apologize. It's come all the way from Ireland, Cork in Ireland, from Thomas. Is that Nuna? Nuna? That's uh, that Nuna? Noonan. Noonan. Thomas Noonan. Big up DJ projects. I heard you might need one of these. So I said, I've got a few spares for you. OG from back in the start, just normally quiet in the comments from Cork Island. Top videos, keep them coming. So thank you very much, Thomas. There's and Tom. what it is, <laughs> a few spare. Oh, definitely got some spares there, mate. Not brand new. Yeah, <laughs> they do look brand new. But yeah, thank you very much, Thomas. I think I'll hold a couple of these back, so because Steve has already got a pack or yes, two packs in his thing, so I'll hold these back. And when we do come to, oh, God, it's going to be a couple of years now. Yeah, because <laughs> don't wear out that quick. But yeah, thank you very much. No. You guys do not have to do yeah. this. Like I said before, big we have shout the out, best, Thomas. 
best subscribers. Always in the comments. Always looking after the boys at the EJ's projects. Yeah. But with that said, we are going to start our day. I have got two grabs to do. The lads are on the crusher today, pushing some more beautiful stone. If the screen is defrosted, we're going to get the screener. Uh, and Stevie is on a fencing job and guaranteed he's going to take you along for the ride. Oh, and sorry. the girls are going to be smashing in the office. Yeah. So let's get to it. Just got it out of the way for Wednesday's thumbnail. Picture up here. <laughs> so, what's what's the plan for them today, Daddy? Explain what the plan is. What's the plan for these lads today? What are they doing? Some of our lovely hardcore now, our jobs. That's it, it's pretty awesome. Yeah. I know, crazy. We've got tons already. Right, that's going for the big boy. So, you can't put too much of a big thing, of course, in this. So that's where the sledgehammer comes in. Yeah. yeah. So we are told it's disappearing. <laughs> <laughs> got any sense. <laughs> but it's creating some crazy guys. That's really good. That is all that stone, basically. Let me get my words out. All that stone, pretty much had, has come from that there. So you can imagine how much hardcore was in there, guys. That we was paying to get rid of. Now look at it. It's perfect for the jobs. Yeah. We are saving the planet one brick at a time. That's it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, right, let's get cracked on with a day. We are selling hundreds of these at the moment. Four pound a slab. Crazy guys, 600 by 600. What a difference, four pound each. Dad's obviously gonna take you along. And we'll take you along as well. Let's get it. You'll see Dad's clips first. And then you'll see ours after, so see you later, guys. So, yeah, we're around the front now. We are loading Mighty White Truck. Jamie is taking full advantage of being employee of the month. He's got his medal on. Yeah, the lads love the medal, so thank you very much. That subscribe was sent him in. But we are putting 25 bags of cement in the tum bag so we can lift them straight off. I am now doing my vehicle checks. We're going around the front, so the lads can load it while I'm doing the vehicle checks and the taco's already in. So yeah, I believe Stevie might have already gone. Has Stevie gone? No, Stevie's still here, he's loading up around the side. But yeah, we've got a couple of grabs to do and some bag drop-offs, and then we're back in the yard, back on the Santa, and if we can get the soil screener going, we're gonna do some soil screen today. The boys at Sherwood Sheds are loading up. Looks like for their day, they've got a busy day, look like a couple of big sheds on there. So yeah. Let me get all these vehicle checks done. Don't know. Everything's on, we are good to go. I believe first drop is in Gadlin. And then we're back to Manders. So yeah, let's get to it. This one's got the boards down. This is the five ton of road stone, uh, three sharp sand, and all the cement's going to this. Oh, 
There we have it. All nicely dropped onto the next one. Petrol station stop, now it's off to Manders. Freedom, I never had the chance to run. Leave behind the sin done, figure out what's to come. There we have it guys, it's this one, so let's get it on. The number one all finished, on to the next. So then we are back at this job with Matt, he's hiding. And what we're doing? Lifting the digger off the scaffolding. The digger I took up the steps. Now we're just under a straightforward lift and get it down off the scaffolding. Jordan's just putting the chains on there and then we're going to connect into the digger and a straightforward lift down. Hopefully, fingers crossed, it goes down in one piece and the higher company don't build Matt. So yeah, let's get it down. Done. So now we pulled that little job in, we've had to see how I get his tips off and then we're delivering nine to the top soil. Nine to the top soil and doing another grab. All tips off back at the yard, we've just loaded up with nine ton of our top soil and we just tipped that one just there. So let's go and get this done and go and do that grab. So we're just at our next one and I'm watching the scales as Jordan grabs it off. Just see on the back, he's grabbing it off. It's four ton at this one five ton in the next one so I'll give him a shout when he's took four ton up. Just give Jordan the nod. Five and two hundred so that's close enough. Let's put legs up now and we'll be on our way. Here's our next one just dropping the soil there it looks like they're re-turfing it I'm just grabbing that. Another one done, a five ton of ice cream top saw and a grab away. Let's go back to the yard. Hello guys and welcome back to me and Asna, this part of the video. Me and Asna are on a bit of a fencing install today, nothing too crazy. There is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, six by six panels to be replaced. It's going to be a bit trickier because they're on two gravel boards. Some are bowing out, hopefully that's just that's just a panel and not because they're super tight because if they are super tight we're going to struggle they've got a bit of a wobble so that's always nice that's getting chopped down to the floor that's getting chopped down to the floor I believe customers going to sort that out get rid of that um yeah this is for a subscriber so big shout out to you buddy thank you for watching the videos and to the missus if she does i'm not sure if she does we're also replacing this gate and putting a bay next to it just there running in a straight line it's going to be quite good of course we're going up to this concrete foundation here then we'll just fill in the gap after, probably with a little panel, to be honest, something like that. We'll decide what we're gonna do when we get to that stage. But this gate has seen better days. I don't think this is holding it up now. 
Uh, I think that's it. That must be electrics or something. Yep. What have we got then? Oh, we've got a tea, haven't we, mate? We've got Miss Brown's boys and Homer Simpson. Yes. Uh, oh, I would assume this is holding this up. Yes, I would assume that is. So, is it tied? Where's the tie? Oh, there she is, look. Let's undo that and see if she falls, eh? I reckon, mate. That's just my elbows. Is that your elbows? <laughs> yeah, they're still warming up. Because <laughs> what's the weather still saying? Minus one. Here we go. Oh, a lot of noises. I actually think the gate is resting on the ground. I don't think she's meant to look like that. What do you reckon, guys? Meant to look like that? I don't think so. Gustaba. Let's get this out and crack on. So then guys, we've got the post in, as it's just about to use his clicky fingers to get this gravel in. And there we have, gravel in. 58 and a quarter, 58 and a quarter. Gonna get a little panel for that. Just put a timber onto this post right here, guys. Now we're gonna get a English. Gonna get a timber up there, level across, so that the gate level, level. It's gonna look quite nice, that one, guys. And they're onto the big hard stuff. This is relatively easy in comparison to what I think we're gonna have to deal with because that's eight foot tall. We've got six by six panels, two gravel boards. We've got the step up so we can actually stand up. Look at the height of some of the posts. It's gonna be hard, definitely gonna be hard. Well, we'll get this timber on with a time lapse. And it's as simple as that, so. I'll take a measurement now, guys. Send that to Jamie. Jamie will make that gate and I'll have a gate and a panel. Customers come out with a Galaxy Ripples, guys. Absolutely love the Galaxy Ripple. Smooth chocolate Galaxy. It's probably one of my favorites. If I'm not having something to do with caramel, Galaxy, if it's, if it's the Ripple, if it's the normal Galaxies, Galaxy is the way forward. Smooth as butter, chocolate. Well, enough of this. It's time for this. We're gonna do the first one raw. It looks like it's gonna be a pain to get it out because I can see ivy on it attached. And that normally means bad things. God, look how tall it is. Well, are we gonna get these out, Asla? <laughs> there's like an electric fence behind it. Been told it's off because there's a Volvo car dealership behind. It better be off. Yeah, I think we need to snap this piece of ivy off here. Let me get rid of my ripple because I don't want to crack it. And then we'll catch these back trees. up. I love them. What do you guys reckon? Do you like these trees? Got two over there as well. Absolutely love those trees. Feels like you're abroad. Tropical. Let's get it. What a difference a few panels makes, right? But this bad boy's in the way now, so let's get it down.
Oh, bloody difference, eh? Feels like the garden's 10 times bigger. Yeah, we crack on again. Asna, magic fingers for these next two if you want me. There we have it. Double trouble, double fingers. Better already. What we got? One, two, three, four to go, guys. Four to go. We'll slide this one in raw for you. Almost tight. Two sets right. Oh, the bushes are gone. We're taking them now. What a difference, eh? What a difference a little bit of panel replacement makes. Absolute. I don't know what I'm going to say, but solid, 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 solid work for me and Asne. Let's have a look on screen now, guys, of what it was looking like. Look at it now. It's a different garden. Right. What are we doing now? Heading back to the yard uh, to empty the van of panels uh, and tools that we don't need. And then we are coming back to one, pick up this, but two, install the gate and the panel there. So we'll see you when we get back. We're back. Uh, where can I put you? I'll put you over there, guys. I'll put you over here. And then you can watch. Just slide this in. Almost do this by yourself properly, but... Ready? One, two, three. <laughs> well, I say that can't be right. What, we are here? It's me. Oh, is it you? What 
looks pretty good that does now nah, time for the gate guys i'll get the tripod up we'll probably do a time lapse That's what we like to see. Right, clappers on the other side. So again, nothing pushes past. And when this pushes, it hits the clapper there rather than pushes past and then bends this. That's why we use these bad boys. Some would say, me included, not too shabby. We're back in the yard guys and we're smashing it it's like a bloody production line the lads are absolutely smashing it these two here have smashed it for the past couple of days probably jordan as well but these guys man they've been crushing look at them it is absolutely crazy big shout out to finn big shout out to mason big shout out to jordan just a big shout out to everyone it's just crazy guys i love it absolutely love it obviously we've got the tiger we've got the other little mini crusher that's just going to fix that and then we're going to start doing the concrete posts here. I believe the plan is, I think this is what my dad said, push the concrete posts into the gorilla buckets, pick the gorilla buckets up, chuck them into the tiger without any rebar and then we'll put the rebar into the scrap. We can use the scrap as the Christmas bonus. It's a win-win, guys. Now that stuff can be screened. So it was over there, but it's gonna be screened now because we took all the rubbish out of it basically. So you can see what dad's doing. He's giving it a shake and any of the rocks here, look, he'll chuck them there, Jordan will put them there. It's like a well-oiled machine. Truly a well-oiled machine. I think that's uh, that's actually not made for that. That was, uh, what's that again? That's a, a rake, ain't it? But it's working out perfect. It's a landscaping rake for like the shrubberies and that when you're pulling stuff rather than taking the ground. Now it's doing it to, it's basically screening it and then we'll put that on the proper screener. You, you're like, what else could you ask for guys? Look at this, this will be good, look. So dad will get that down and then let me just show you this. So get rid of the soil, chuck that there. There we go, quite a bit of soil in that. So he puts it in the soil, puts it there. You can't go wrong. Look how far the pile's gone down. It was out here the other day. Look at it. Oh, we love this game, guys. We love it. And then obviously we've got that bad boy over there, look. Let me show you. So it's going in buckets like that, like this one. But obviously this has got rebar in. So we're putting it there. And then it's going in there because that's a bit too big at the minute. We want it like that. And then that goes and gets tipped in there. We love this game.
morning, it is Wednesday morning and it's a bright one. Sun is lovely today. It's cold, but it's bright. The video goes live today, so if you haven't already watched it, pause this video, head over there and give us boys at DJ Project some support. What are we doing today? We are fully loaded with roadstone and bags and cement. To a lovely customer of ours, or a trader, should I say. But yeah, we just stopped. Let's get a Costa, because it is cold. Minus two. But yeah, it's, it's frost on the ground, frost on the cars. So we're just going to warm the bones up. We're about halfway to our destination. So we thought, you know what, we'll grab a Costa, get a Costa, warm the bones up and get to this job. So next time you see us, we'll be on the job. So then guys, we're here. That is a lovely load because I bought a little crusher now. I haven't told these guys yet, but yeah, I bought a little crusher and that will go straight through it. We'll screen the soil. Jordan just up there now, sorting it out. So let's get it done. I'm not going to blow my own trumpet, but you don't get much better than that, do you? All on the sheet. None on the road. <laughs> we love this game. There we have it guys, took what we could. It's gonna be another one here anyway, so we're back here probably tomorrow or later on in this week. So we are all loaded up and ready to go. That's quite a good one. The lads will pick the concrete out of that and we'll screen the soil. So yeah, a really good load that one. Let's head back to the yard. This is Finn's new baby, as you saw earlier in the video. He's going for the big boys, I can't lie. Well, we must have some action. There she goes, look. And obviously, of course, need not worry, guys, there's no blades or anything. So with your hand in there, nothing can go wrong. But when it's nothing in there, I'll show you. It's just open space. I don't know how it does it, it just shakes it. Yeah, like, it's nothing in there. So there's no blades or anything. So when you see them chucking in and they're pushing it down, obviously, we're always careful, but there is nothing to catch it here. One thing for sure is creating a proper, proper good product. guys no idea what it is but Charles says got to open it I saw a DPD van pull up so I knew we had to deliver it but it's a D&J project assuming it's one from one of you lovely subscribers it does say food items so oh yeah <laughs> oh we're gonna enjoy these crispy cremes chock full of love now I know this won't have been cheap so you didn't have to do that well, thank you very much Okay, you ready? You can see it first, guys. You can't see it yet. <laughs> I've never seen it like that before. You ready? Oh, the oh my oh. god! Look at that! Oh my god! The small guys, like right? well, couldn't even speak English, but the small nice guys. If it was smelly vision, you'd be having a, a whale of a time here. But they must. There must be a note from someone here somewhere, surely. Oh, here we go, yeah. Find it. 
Right then, guys. So this is hope you all enjoy. Mine and my boyfriend's 12 year anniversary is on Valentine's Day. Well, happy 12 year anniversary. He's a follower and we watch all of your episodes. Please, can you give him a shout out? His name is Joseph McGurk. I think that's how you say it. From Saddy Straw. Who's that? Saddy Straw. Oh. Sadie Straw. From Sadie Straw. Sadie Straw. That's a no wonder I've not heard where it's from because it's your name. Sadie. So Sadie Straw and Joseph McGurk. Gurk? McGurk, I believe that is. Well, big shout out to you, Joseph. Thank you for watching the videos. It really does mean the world to us. You never, ever have to send us anything, but the fact that you've sent this in, God knows, this is 20 quid's worth, at least, I bet. You did not have to do that, but thank you ever so much, Seda. It really does mean a lot to us. And to Joseph, thank you for watching the videos. And happy anniversary to you both on Valentine's Day. <laughs> 12 years, well done. Nice and strong. Thank you, guys. So then guys, you've seen a bit of drone footage of me coming back in the yard. We've lost Jordan. Jordan has been sick, he was sick on site. I didn't mention it on the way back because it, it feels really, really bad. So yeah, he's been sick. Hopefully it's a 24 hour bug, but I've got our boy Quinn. Quinn's gonna give me and do this one because it's unloading slabs and then we've got to muck away. Uh, but first we've got five ton of top, so we've got all loaded up on the back. I haven't shown you, but I will show you when we get there. So yeah, let's get this soil off the back. Uh, then we'll head to the next one, do that. Jordan's gonna meet us because I couldn't get all the slabs on the back of this. I wanted to, but I couldn't. So yeah, it's gonna be a busy one. Then we've got a quote to do on the way back. But yeah, we're running really efficient. The screening's going well. I mean, the cushion's going well. Not screening, we started screening her up. Yeah, let's ramble. Let's get out there. Let's get this done. So then this is an interesting one. We are putting a bit of our lovely topsoil in that there for a subscriber. And then we're filling them planters in over there. I'll show you the planters when we've done it, and then we'll be on our way. There we have it, guys. Just filled the planter. I believe he's having growing vegetables in this one, and a few plants. So that's what he said. But there's some some horses over there. There's a little tiny horse as well. I'll just show you before we go. One especially for Jordan. There's a little tiny one just down there. Just the right size for Jordan. And there's another little tiny one over there. Let's hit the road and deliver that next deliverer. I couldn't dive off without showing you guys these. Look at these. I think we've got food. It's going to be something to eat my phone, look. 
<laughs> but that's our little one, Jordan, especially for you. Look at that. Compared to that one, just your size, mate. Yeah, beautiful, absolutely beautiful. But we're definitely going now, 100%. So here we are on the next one. It's all that lovely turf and soil. And all that is gonna go there. And we're somewhere else, by magic. We're picking a bag up. Quinn's just doing that, so we're getting rid of that for these gentlemen who watches the video. So there we have it, guys. Class one of the day, isn't it, mate? Class one of the day for a lovely gentleman. We've just got rid of some wood for him. And yeah, he's gonna have some fencing off us, so he's gonna get Steve around. So next time you see us, we are. We're running out of room again, guys. I think the plan is to get rid of this to extend this bay and make it bigger. Obviously, yes, it's going to fall down, but it's easy to get the wood off, so don't worry about stuff that's falling in. Yeah. Lads have smashed it. Absolutely smashed it. Let us know in the comments if that little beast right there, the tiger, is already proving a good investment. I think we need a proper name for it as well. What? It's Tiger Bike 400. There's been some names in the comments down below. I've seen some good ones. Barney Rumbles or Barney Rubble, I think I saw something like that. Let us know in the comments if you have got a good name for that tiger bag. So it is the end of the day. I've been back a little while. I've just been told there's some donuts to give out. So we're going to get these donuts out. Chelsea's well, well up here. Oh, I won't. <laughs> everyone wants to go home. So yeah, we're going to get these out. So hello see. guys and good morning. It's me. It's Asne. It's on this fine, fresh day. Oh, you can't see my watch because it's locked in there. That tells you how cold it is. I've had to put my watch away. Right, fencing today. One of these posts are being replaced. I think it's this one here. Can you see where the gravel board's out there, guys? Look, it's not even in the post no more. So we need to sort that out. Don't know if it's been caught. There is a tree stump on the other side, so I don't know if that's pushing that away. But Dad's going to be bringing a sun here because he's got a tree stump to take out there, tree stump to take out there. So he's going to come down there and across here. There are some panels just up there. I think we're putting six befores in there and then post extenders. I believe that's what's happening. So that's what we're going to do, guys. So we're going to get probably this panel out and this panel. We'll probably take three of them out and then we'll go from there. So once we've got these out and we get inside, we'll explain what we're doing. So those panels out. We've took the gravel board out here, guys, because this is coming out. It's bloody massive. It's solid. This one's coming out. Look at the roots. It's like they join. This is coming out. Oh, my dad's expecting big things. Getting these out with a sani. Look at it. Well, I believe that sani can do it. Customer, subscriber. Yeah, treating us. I've seen bold teasers there, big bag as well. Oh, quality streets. Oh, cakes, all sorts, teas. Yes, yeah, customers sorting us out, looking after us. So big shout out to you, buddy. I'm sure you'll be watching this. Thank you for looking after us. We say it all the time. You guys don't have to. You don't have to look after us as much as you do. Just having us in to do the job, that is more than sort of appreciated. So big shout out to you, buddy. Thank you for watching the videos. Oh, look at this, guys. Look at oh, this. It's amazing. Missing out on all this look. We've got cakes. We've got these bars. We've got chocolates. More teasers. And he already knew we liked tea, so he got the teas on. Like, you, you can't beat it, can you, hasn't yeah, it? You can't, you can't beat it. You can't beat it. Thank you guys, thank you so much. I do, I'm gonna have this, of course, because it's rude not to. Not, we're not gonna eat the old tub right now, I don't get me wrong. Um, yeah. Oh, this is being changed as well, sorry, I forgot to mention this. This is being changed with, uh, oh. Six before's. Six I believe, and then post extenders on top. I'm just gonna ring my dad and go through that. Asni will just get the tape and then we'll measure up. I believe what we'll do, if any gravel boards need an adjustment, we'll adjust for level. But looking at them, they're all pretty close to pretty good. I couldn't speak English, sorry. Next door, yeah, nothing in the way there, so you can adjust them. Good this wheel. I better take pictures, really, and as there. Yeah. I better take some pictures, so let me do that. So this one's sitting nice. Um, the situation that we've got going on here, guys, is that post is running up that way too far. So this needs to be a custom panel. Pretty straight that way. Well, I say that, let's have a look. Let's have a look. It's not perfect, but it ain't the worst. It's within the bubble touching the line. No, this one's not bad either. Why is that not going in there then? Measurement, you got your tape on your eyes, let's, let's see what the top looks like. Or bottom, either. 
Well, I'll just... What you got, Asna? 73. 73. 73. Obviously, panels are, just to show you, should be 72. We chuck that on there. We go across. 6 foot, 71, 72, and it was 73. That's how much it is uh, at the top. So we need a panel longer at the top. What about the bottom, mate? Do we need 73 at the bottom? So if I go flush, guys, and Asner goes in, 6 foot, 72. So, 73 at the top then, yeah? yeah? So we need a six foot by, sort of six foot, but then 73 at the top. So Jamie will have to make a panel like that, guys. This one, this needs to be fully custom because there's no gravel board. And um, there's a concrete sort of haunch in there to get the level. I'm not sure why they've done that, but that's what they've done. So we'll sit it back on that. And then this panel will have to be custom because that's going to be up taller anyway. So this one would have to be taller. So if you go up another eight inches from the top, mate, 58... That's where that panel needs to be made to. And a four foot panel, which we've got, would take it there. So yeah, that's no stress, no stress at all guys. So we're basically just gonna keep doing this. Work our way down, take one out, put one in. Take one out, put one in, sort of all the way down. The ones that don't sit in how we need it to, probably like this one right here. That gravel needs lifting anyway. That might pull that back in, sort of like that. But we'll tell, I guess, when we take it out, so yeah. Thought I'd explain, because sometimes you have got jobs like this. So uh, let's just crack on. So, don't be fooled, this one, we believe we need a new panel. And we definitely need a new panel in that one. We just left them in, but those two, they need coming out. Yep, 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 yep. And that's a custom. I'd take the guttering off to slide that one in. Um, we can slide that one in now. Of course, we'll put a guttering back. All right, let's have a look. Because we've leveled everything now all the gravel boards everything's sitting ready for panels where's the spirit right so uh i'm not sure what i'm doing there that concrete might be coming out we might be doing that ourselves right level level let me get it on all right uh slight tap down this end hasn't you got the hammer mate we are being anal with it but it's a little tap down this end. This panel's coming out as well, remember guys. A little tap on the panel. And again, one more. So close. Right, little adjustment on that one. Uh, same again this side, mate. A little tap this side. Level. Level, Neville. Level. We ain't done that with this one. Uh, little adjustment left hand side. That's what we're dealing with. It's, um, I guess it is what it is, isn't it, guys? It is what it is. It's me and Asne scratch our heads on this job. Let's go and see what my dad's been up to today. So then, you've seen the job Stevie and Ant are doing. I am doing one quick grab. The lads are on deliveries and with the trailer or without the trailer, without the trailer, but I need 17 plates. So yeah, lads on delivery, so then they come back, then we'll get the sunny loaded up. By that time, I should be back to pick the sunny up and we'll be out to that job. So yeah, let's get this grab done. So then guys, this is the grab. You just see me pull up on the drive. We're quoting to do the drive. We might get it, we might not. It's gonna be a resin one, I believe. That's what I'm quoting for anyway, and it is big. But our first job is grab that stone and the ballast and put it on there. But yes, we have got a telegraph wire. 
So got his pole up, he's gonna lift that telegraph wire up and we're gonna grab it off. Nice easy one guys. We love this game. So then uh, guys, we are fully loaded, fully strapped up and ready to go. So yeah, let's go and get these stumps out. All right, we're on site. Stevie's already showing you the job. So I'm just here to take them stumps out. Say so just to take them stumps out. Yeah. They're quite, they're quite a tasty stump. And that one is, I think they've been here a while. We have mentioned to the customer obviously about damages if they have to have it, but they're adamant they want these stumps out, they don't want stump grinding. So, and big shout out to the customer because he's, uh, he's ordering a Domino's for lunch and he says, what do you want? What do you want on your Domino's? So no. I'll be dragging this one out to lunch then. <laughs> <laughs> I was going to be in an hour, but yeah, I think I'll be uh, having a bit of Ant's pizza. That's it, I don't mind sharing. Yeah, yeah sharing's caring, isn't it, Ant? That's it, mate. Sharing's it's caring. It's pepperoni, because that's not ramen. Soft crust? Oh, what? <laughs> He's having veggie. He's having the veggie one. You don't eat that meat. Oh, I've gone to the road. I love pepperoni. It's not my favourite, but yeah. What's your favourite pizza? That's a good one. Yeah. What's your favourite topping on a pizza? And what's your favourite topping? One, two, three, go. Pepperoni. Stay. One, two, three. Pepperoni. I'll ask you, right. lads. I'll ask you. Right, pepperoni, but it's got to have, if it's from Domino's, it's got to have double decadence. If anyone knows what a double decadence oh. is. That's the only time I'll have pepperoni. That with but cheese. Obviously, yeah. I on like crust, not on the crust, on the stuffed base. crust, and I do like barbecue Texas pizza. Barbecue. Yeah, yeah, Texas like barbecue, barbecue. Texas yeah. barbecue. I like that. I really. I'm a big fan of Texas yeah. barbecue. Texas oh, and when we go to New York, I'm having one of them dollar slices. 100. Yeah. percent Toast are good. So. I know he's gonna send me a picture. Yeah, 100, yeah, yeah. percent mate. <laughs> right, let's talk in. Let's get these out so we can have Donny Moe's. Who? Donny Moe's. Donny Moe's. <laughs> we have pizza. So yeah, Sunny's here. Hopefully, it makes light work to it. Hopefully, it makes light work to. Hopefully, it makes light work of this. He's got big hopes. He says. Sally the Sunny. Sally the Sunny. Let's see how strong she is. To be fair, she's a beast of a machine. Even if she does struggle, we still love her. There is roots like everywhere. Look tough, can't lie, guys. Fallen one too many times, feeling like another ends back again. Square one, try to leave myself behind, looking for a better place, not to stay alone. Gain our trust, and you chose to break it. You only fake it Thought you said what we had was sacred It's all lies, all lies I was broken and isolated But inside held the fire waiting 
Now you can imagine, can't you guys? You know when you've got trees, look at that tree over there, next to a house, and obviously we're cutting off. You can see why some insurances don't wanna insure you when you've got trees next to your house, because they spread for miles. Sally, the sun is being destructive. We love it. Look at this. Look at this. Guys, 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 guys. I can't be having this. Oh my God, customer. Rover, you're looking after us too well. You're looking after us too, too well. What a good egg, what a good egg. Can't believe it. Two, two, two large dominoes. Oh my God. Thank you, buddy, thank you. So, for everyone wondering, I'm not sure what these are called. The customer did tell me the chap. I can't remember, I'm gonna find out, but they are bloody good, they are. Um, I'm gonna have that one, as, as Nick can have this one, because I'm touching it. Don't, don't tell him. That's telling me, Asne, we've got to replace that. Yep. That was a big, <laughs> that's a big hole. Jesus. Oh, that big there. Look at that. He's looked after us too well there. He's a good egg. One of the best customers we've had really for that, mate. That's crazy. So, pizza was a scrumptious. <laughs> Looks like I've got my wraps tomorrow. <laughs> so yeah, this one's a little bit more difficult. We've took the corner post out. Don't know if you've seen it on time-lapse, not sure. We've got a massive trunk size route here. So I think get that one out and then try and roll it out on itself. That's the plan anyway. Never goes to plan, but that's the plan. We have got one here, I believe, as well. That brick, that's brick. So let's talk you more action because I need to go back on the ground. Didn't think I'd go this far, but here we are, the end. Now you're just a lesson learned. A slowly fading memory so I can breathe again. Gain our trust and you chose to break it. Ask for truth, but you only fake it. Thought you said what we had was sacred. It's all lies, all lies. So, it's basically all that. Right. It's the tidying up of the twigs and stuff now. I'm about to go back to the yard, get the panels for that sort of stuff there. That, well, I say that sort of stuff. Let's speak actually in English sentences. I'm gonna get the panels so we can continue that fencing there. My dad and Asni are gonna tidy this part up here. So yeah, gonna go back to the yard, get the stuff. Uh, if uh, my dad and Asni film, we'll go from there. Just the final stump to get on. Let's get it on. then that's all loaded up on stevie's van the sunny is on the trailer i'm going to head back now because i've got a grab to do and these boys are going to sort the fencing out and stevie's hugging that pizza like no one's going to have it pizza. cold pizza i love, I love cold pizza so yeah leaving the cable hands of steve Definitely not too shabby. 
that panel is for there. Jamie's going to make this panel and the extender for that and that. It's because we had to we had to mess around with this gravel wall to get it to work, guys. So we're going to get it to work perfectly how it should. Also, we'll take this uh, bit of rockery now and we'll be back here tomorrow, guys. So if my dad filmed anything else, we'll go and see it now. If he didn't, we'll catch you in the morning. So hello guys, it is currently Saturday, the day before the video, which is tomorrow. Uh, the last thing you've seen... Hey! Yeah, I, did think, I, did have to, I did have to think about it to say that then. Um, oh, what, what was it? What did I say? I said Nottingham. Nottingham. Nottingham, and I can't get my words out for some reason. Shabbe. 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 Not too shabbe. Not shabbe. too shabbe. Uh, Jesus, what, what was the last thing you saw? Scene! Man! <laughs> <laughs> ah, um, I think it was to do with the post extenders you'll have to see the rest of that this coming Wednesday because the video is an hour and something long dad's going to New York we wanted to get another Wednesday video in the bank so we can watch it before he goes to New York um, but yeah end of video guys so like Stevie said this comes to the conclusion of the end of the video you have seen the crusher comments down below i think that's an amazing piece of kit the lads absolutely love it you've seen the sunny art take them stumps out i mean that made like work of it yeah it did and they were big. really really made like work of it you've seen plenty of fencing this week you've seen post extenders yep something a little bit different you've seen plenty of grabs because you've been asking for it but with that said it's another week at d and j i'll see you in the next one guys